All right, guys, want to welcome you real quick. This is GTA Vice City Definitive Edition. Uh, yeah, been looking forward to this since it was announced. It was only something like two or three months ago it was announced, but yeah. Uh, really, really been looking forward to this. I've, a few missions in now. Uh, just want to say a quick hello. Wanted to do me intro. I wanted to do it outside the Ocean View Hotel. Mainly so I can show you, like, this neon sign. You know what I mean? It's really fantastic. A big real upgrade. They've done a lot of beautiful work on it. You'll see it during the gameplay. Anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed Tommy Vassetti? Ha! <laughs> Shit! Didn't think they'd ever let him out. He kept his head down. Helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? We treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town, okay? We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, hell, even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, Sonny. None of the families will touch that shit. Time to change it. The families can't keep their backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we send someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice, quiet slice, okay? Who's our contact down there? Ken Rosenberg. Schmuck of a lawyer. How's he gonna hold Vercetti's leash? We don't need him to. We just set him loose in Vice City. We give him a little cash to get started, okay? Give it a few months, then we go down. Pay him a little visit, right? See how he's doing. Hey, hey, guys, it's uh, Ken Rosenberg here. Hey, hey, great, hey. Well, uh, I'm gonna drive you guys to the meet, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers, and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So, uh, if all goes well, we should uh, be doing very nice for ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so, they're brothers, okay? One operates the, uh, the business, and the other one does the flying. Okay, that's them in the chopper. All right, here's the deal. They want a straight exchange on open ground. All right? Okay, stay tight, let's go. Got it? 100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s. Used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shovels shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. All right, so we go. This is on PC, as you can see. Uh, one thing I'm worried about, uh, for the first video, as you can see, the radio stations do come on. I can turn that off. Um... I may have issues with copyright, I don't know yet. Something new, I want to point out, if you look at the corner, the GPS, the sat-nav, it didn't have, uh, like, the guide on it, in the original one. Look at all this, man. The lighting on it, beautiful, even on the road and everything. Should have found the hotel fronts. All bridges in some roads in the Vice City metropolitan area have been closed because of All bridges are closed to the mainland. Yeah, the old style GTA where you had to walk into the save icon. I think it was only, was it GTA 5 that took that away for the first time? I forget. Hello, Sonny. 
Tommy! Tommy, it's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money. No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with. Wait, Sonny. You have my personal assurance that I'm going to get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm going to mail you the dicks of those responsible. Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already. But because it's you, because we got history, I'm going to let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. All right, so we gotta go back to see uh, Ken's mo Ken Rosenberg. Even. Let's escape to open the map of the city. Oh, there was zoom in, and it's just a mouse wheel. Okay. Change the camera fuse. Yeah. Oh, look how beautiful this looks. I can't rotate the camera though. Man, killer soundtrack. Yeah, I think it may just include it in the first video. I'll see how I get on with the copyright strikes. And um, hopefully we get away with some things, I'm not sure. But it is 2021 on YouTube, so probably not. Uh, so I may have to put them out for the others. <laughs> As you can see, I've not done keyboard and mouse in a long time. I'm just looking. Yeah, the ads, just looking at the cap back there. Um, you can take on... Uh, all different types of missions, like if you've got a cop car, you can do vigilante missions, ambulance, you can do, you know, those type of missions, taxi driver missions, you know, it's very good. Loads to do. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. These gorillas, listen to me, are going to come down here and rip my head off. It's re... Ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we gonna do? Shut up, sit down, relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine, and then we're gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht, and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite. Of course I have an invite. But there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door. No I way, not I told you, happen. shut up. I'll go myself. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't gonna be a beer and strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here, stop by Raphael's. Tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go, come on. Who does that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Uh, really Alta has got a very distinctive voice, hasn't he? Just me the cat. Uh, some of the... I mean, the cast in this was really... It's big now. It was especially big back then. I think it was 2002, this release. Uh, obviously, Ray Liotta. That's Tommy Vizzetti. We've got Bill Fitzner was the lawyer. Um, the guy, Sonny. Uh, do you know the mobster? The one on the phone. That is Tom Sizemore. There's just so many. I'll try and kind of reel them out as we meet. Just going off a bit of memory here. Oh, something else I wanted to show you, actually. Radio station wheels. Go back to your homes. Florida does not want I know they had some you. issues. Uh, they've taken quite a few of them away. I think GTA got away with a lot. A river. Um, we need a ri but Vice City and San Andreas got it quite bad with music and stuff. 
excitement. Like lost the rights to play them or something. I don't know. I don't remember uh, Vizetti having a like stubble. I don't remember that. And even though it was only like low gen graphics, surely you know I would have imagined. Uh, what were the controls then? Something about that control. Oh, that's how you pop a wheelie. I do remember some of the missions being very difficult in this. I remember that. One of them uh, involving a bike race later on. And one of them where you've got to steal something from the military. I remember cheats being used for that. I may use cheats in this, I don't know. I wondered, there was a gun. Still there, in the original one. I always remember this. Um, I think we get one shortly anyway. Alright, the party. Buenas noches. I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or uh, mental well-being, Mr. Rossetti. He's just got a touch of agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter will take time. Perhaps we'll talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you to my daughter. Miss Davis! Karamia, could you look after our guest while I attend to my necessary obligations? Of course, Daddy. Please, excuse me. Mercedes? You try living with him. Anyway, let me point out some of our more distinguished guests. That's our Congressman Alex Shrub with Rising Silicone Star. Candy and have you met my lovely wife, Laura? No? Well, uh, unfortunately, she's in Alabama. This is Candy. And over there, we have the Vice City Mamba star titan, BJ. Always the charmer. I blocked down on him, and then I put him in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Well, now, I'm looking at some prime... Risk. And that poolside amphibian is Jez Torrent, lead singer with Love Fest. Yeah, can I tell you? Do you know how they play ping pong? In silence. Let me tell you. It does not involve a battle, if you know what. Impotent. And the chatty trio, that sleeping sweat gland is Papa's right-hand gimp, Gonzalez. And the other two are Pastor Richards and pseudo-intellectual film director Fish Steve Scott. throws a passion with the Nipho invaders when the giant shark comes in and just bites their dicks off. And now, you never saw anything like that before. Colonel, your party's as ever a triumph. <laughs> I can only apologize. Well, de nada, amigo. How do we find you? <coughs> Our business is very dry. Barbarians at the gate. A time for rewarding one's friends and liquidating one's enemies, amigo. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz. He's Mr. Cole. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get the out of here. Sure Actually, take me to the pole position. Drinks. I didn't cut that scene early, by the way. We need something to aim for, like being rich and laughing at poor people, or oh, I didn't even notice before the um. At the Will you be working for my father? Maybe. Do you mind me resting my hand in your lap? Maybe. <laughs> so difficult having um, a rich yeah, it slows down. Father. Do you know when you're changing wow. radio stations? Yes, and this. I wonder if the weapon wheel is going to be the same. Oh, where's it going? When I first come to Vice City, I feel all lonely. A man on the outside, a foreigner. Then I say, Fernando, you like to talk a lot. Man, I love so these I stations, well Fernando. The and begin to make my name for yourself. As a successful DJ. Now I'm not so lonely, but I never. Do you know what? My roots. I've been playing Red Dead Redemption 2, as you guys know my channel anyway, and um, GTA, and I forgot. You can't just like. See it doesn't stop around, automatically. Handsome. Do you know what the pink markers? Sure you will.
Alright, hundred dollars. This you can buy, not at this time. Well, come up in a bit. You can buy properties and you can the uh, builder's empire. Does it say how much it is? No. I think it goes green if I remember when you, it's been years since I've done it. I did get this on a PS4. Uh, but I didn't play much of it. Once I was playing the later games, trying to go back to this, uh, the graphics were like a little too outdated for me. If you see what I mean. Yeah, as I said before, guys, with the music, I'd love to leave the music throughout this whole thing. Um, but... I've got to be wary of copyright checks, as I say. I'm not sure I'm going to do this series exactly whether it's going to be... It's going to be all the story. I know that. Um, but maybe... Some, look at him, I've got Boogie, this is one. Um, but maybe some of the side quests. I, I don't know, to be honest. I've not really made the plan. Well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it! Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slimeball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, alright? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. Boy Scout, slow down. Looks wired off us, not Tony. Uh, the Malibu is the famous club in this, isn't it? The game is very similar to Scarface. Uh, you will see a lot of references, particularly later on. I want to try and keep it spoiler free, but for those who have played the game, know this game as much as me, you will know what I mean. Um, one of the cast coming up, you will recognise his voice. It's this guy Paul, it's Danny Dyer, famous gangster actor, uh, now in EastEnders. Infamous company dude. Yeah, again, here's another property you can buy, the Malibu Club. Malibu Club. Struggling. Where'd you pop up from? I've been looking for a bird like you for ages, mate. You know what I am? Looking for some English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. You know what I mean? I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing, mate. Get lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. I'm Kent Paul. I'm a friend of Rosenberg's. Rosenberg. Rosenberg. Oh, that bonkers ambulance chaser. That guy could defend an innocent man all the way to death row. <laughs> Get another drink, bruv. But he's a comedian. Listen to me. I'm missing 20 keys and a lot of cash. Drugs, mate? It's a mugs game. What do you know about it? Oi, oi, well, what I was coming to was, there's some chef come trumpet shifter who deals that kitchen of Hotel and Ocean Drive. He's been looking real pleased with himself lately. You could go and check him out. I will. And I'll be seeing you around. That's right, go and walk away, you mug. I knock you spark out. Give me a drink. And where's that slut? He's proper badass to me, isn't he? That, I think, um... I mean, if, if you ever see Danny Dyer when he talks, like... When it's just him talking, I'm not, I don't mean when he's, like... Being a character. When he's in the TV. When he's on, like, talk shows and stuff like that. That is how we genuinely talk, so... I've got the feeling that... Didn't even kind of write the script for him, he just kind of went, look, his baseline, and you just be you. Because that is very much him. Uh, where am I going? Down the alley. Hey, what you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. You stupid prick! That's how can we lock onto them? I don't know. I'll pick up a cell phone. Oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh yeah? 
And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. No need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's back. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. Right, we've already acquired the gun anyway. This way. Oh, the shooting's well better. Well, let me get a bit of distance here. Still getting used to the camera. <laughs> oh yeah, let me get this cop once a level thing. Alright, it's only a one star, we should get away with it. Yeah, it's got like a real good flea, uh, free aim. Free aim. I'm not sure how long this first video is going to be. One thing you got to realize about this town, you got to pack some heat. A local gun shop is a couple of blocks away. And me. Maybe like 40 minutes to an hour or something like that. Right, follow the gun icon on the radar to find ammunition. Guys, you will have to bear with me driving. It's, as I said, it's been so... The cop hit me. Uh, it's been so long since I've done... Um... Keyboard and mouse. Collar and cuffs. <laughs> I'm not going to explain what that means. To those who don't know. I've only got a hundred dollars, so I we'll really don't want to go to like, uh, do you know, the paint spray. I have got this, I don't know whether I mentioned before, I know I'm meant to, um, on the ultra sentence. Stand at the big market to view the weapons on offer. Okay. Um. So, I mean, to me now it looks really good. The lighting is, especially the lighting. Yeah, it's fantastic. Exit the shop by pressing T. There are eight different types of weapons. All right, you guys can read that if you want to. Um. I don't know how it's going to look after I do the processing and. Um. Obviously, uploading the to, uh, to YouTube because they downgraded it as well. Yeah, I can just use A and D. Alright, we've got a pistol. I assume going over that would just buy more ammunition. We got oh, I thought it was 51 rounds there. Out of stock, out of stock. Body armor. Uh can't buy nothing. Except pistol ammo, but I don't want to get that just yet. I don't think we may not need it very early on in the game. I'm kind of like so tempted to sing it. I'm not gonna. Do you want know to sing along with this? It's a proper Delta Santa. It's what it was like famous for, wasn't it? I mean, that San Jay is famous for its story and whatnot. And this is a good story. Very um, Mafia Scarface type, but yeah, the soundtrack was what I remember most. I'm gonna go see what I can dig up. I'll be watching you, Tommy. Alright, good to $200. Uh, who paid this exactly? Was it Lance? Let me go and change... ...my clothing. Um, forgot what I was going to say now. Where's that room? you now? You okay, Leo? You sound kind of different. Just tell me where you are. Who the hell is this? Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. I'm just looking at this behind us here. Uh, Raphael, so it must be like... I remember them doing it in Bully, if you remember that. Also by Rockstar Games. Um, as you kind of progress through the story, your room changed. With little things. Uh, there's Claude from GTA 3. Up there. Where am I? Don't think he's involved in this game. He was involved in San Andreas for a short little while. That's where we learned his name, in fact. I only learned the other day. I thought I knew everything about this game. Uh, should we save it? 
You can see me uh, auto save from before. Oh, hang on, auto save. I did start it before. What am I doing? Do you know when I was test recording? I'm on a couple of missions. Oh, we have no vehicle. No! <laughs> oh, he, he fell off. That'll do. Is he going to try and come take this back, do you think? Oh, he is, isn't he? Let's see what he does. Yeah, go on. Run away. I don't want to fire. I don't remember them highlighting like that. Screw it. I just miss every shot, shall I? <laughs> there we go. I wasn't missing it. I thought maybe that should have been a one-shot kill. Alright guys, back in a moment. Alright, sorry about that. Um, I just got to do the intro. I've not done the intro yet, you see. Oh! Yeah, I think um, a lot of it, I said earlier, it will just be story. We've not really unlocked any side missions yet. But I may, I, I said, I don't know. I don't know why I'm doing it yet. But 100% it will all be the story. At the very least. I can tell you that much. Oh, I'm no good with this. I'm not very good in the cars, but at least I'm better. I think on a bike I get a little more nervous because as soon as you, you clip anything, you go flying off, don't you? I've noticed, I don't remember it being like that, but the um, missions are very quick fire now, aren't they? On this very, uh, very short. Right, what have we got? Jury Fury. Oh, oh, for God's sake, it's you. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna need new pants. Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon. Now, where is the goddamn money? Relax, relax. We're not at that part oh, yet. Oh, I thought that you were taking care of this. I really did. And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out! I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no! I tried that! The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. Oh! Florida moron. Alright, I know when the melee slip we've got the uh, swap weapon, yeah. The hatchet, wasn't it? We must build right, go on, one second. The north, or they will come down and ruin this um, great state. And yeah, go and intimidate the two jurors, but don't kill them. <laughs> what a stupid question of all the cheek, were you? A lot of, of look not. at that rain. I mean no look at the puddles even that's since nice. 1877. But They've really done well with this, you know, for a, a 2002 game. I thought when I heard about the remaster, I envisioned, like, when they remastered uh, Mafia 1. That was really beautiful, you know what I mean? They actually redone the whole thing. What's it? I'm glitching in the car. Um, that's what I thought it was going to be, but no. But, I mean, it's still good. It's... Bit nostalgic, takes you back. Am I supposed to, like, scare him? Oh, oh, that was easy. George, your senses we got, that's okay. What I used to love about these old games was that a lot of them, like, sort of... Everything is coincided with them. Uh, a lot of them work together. They were based in the same universe. Like they said, GTA 4 and 5 was, but we didn't see a whole lot of like crossovers. Like everyone was wanting to see Nico Bellic in 5, and that didn't happen aside from uh, on a computer screen at some point, if I remember right. 
uh, but this is what I love. I think I remember she's in GTA 3. Don't think she's in this one. But I, I'm sure I've got this right. One of the characters called Catalina. Or Catalina. Um, she was the most recurring character in all of GTA. In this universe. You know, the old 3D universe. The original stuff. Um, her or Salvatore only. Out of all the games, this GTA 3. Uh, San Andreas. I'm going to do it in that. Whole bunch of them. Then you got the spin offs like Vice City Stories, Liberty City Stories. Facts like that really interest me. I don't know why. <laughs> Just whack it till the door falls off. I can't believe this is happening! You remember Giorgio? Remember he's innocent? Ah! All right, money's going up in mission. So we got, um, so what did I spend money on? 729, I don't remember buying nothing. So we got, we got Ken Rosenberg. Once again, the lawyer. Ah, I knew he was going to turn. I thought he was going that way and then it... It dawns on me very quickly that that wasn't there. Um, there was no road there. So let me show you this real quick. You can, I'm sure. Hold up. Hey, Tony, it's Sonny. How's the suntan? I ain't got no suntan. We ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, tell me, what are you doing? I'm looking for the money, Sonny. Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style, because I seem to have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy, please. Do us both a favor. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Does Tommy look skinnier than the original? I think he's, he looks okay there, but during the cutscenes he does. Um, yeah, you can't look at these two. Hello, I'm a girl. Hello, twins. Yeah, you can go inside like some of these buildings. Look at this. I mean, this was, this sounds ridiculous now. Let me put this away. Uh, but, oh. Who now? Get to the payphone next to the mall in Washington. Oh, that's one of the side missions. Remember the payphone missions from the original GTA? Look at this. Who's old enough to remember what that means? The YMCA. Uh, yeah. I mean, stuff like this in the game of 2002, to see that many people in one, like, uh, segments, if you will, that was a huge thing, you know, back then. I only want to show you that you can go inside, really, over the park, there. I, like to munch it vigorously. I, I may show where it's just given us the payphone mission. What's happening there? Face. On Friday nights, I just can't stop eating Rusty Brown's ring donuts. Oh my god. Oh, look at the blood. So He's done. Good. Sometimes I like to wear women's panties and walk around Fifth when you go downtown, Guys, I do apologise. I'm sure talking. I'm losing track of what I'm saying. I'm just getting this chat. I'm tired. I've been up since four o'clock. We are now eight o'clock at night. I've been awake today. Oh yeah, the payphone mission, sorry. It's just I've seen the icon. Um, yeah, I may do like one of them just to show you what, like, kind of like what they are. But like, there's a whole bunch of them, and I think maybe a lot of them are similar. So I don't think I'll show them all. I don't know yet. All right, riot. Hey, Avery goes without saying. Tommy, Tommy, any progress? No, 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 no. Tell me later. Tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party. Not in person. Howdy. Avery here has a proposition. <clears throat> Haven't we got other things on our mind? I'm trying to keep the wolves from the door. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any greaseballs giving you a hard time, I'll see to it they take a long dirt nap. Okay, what could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. The security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop by Raphael's for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, go for it. Should be a riot. If the balls drop like they should, stop by my office sometime. 
Who are these pricks anyway? Lawyer pricks, rug wearing pricks, surrounded by pricks. <laughs> Do you know what? Originally, I was going to use a controller for this. That's how I play most of my PC games anyway. And more property you play. Um, but I'm sticking with the keyboard and mouse for the time being, as I discussed earlier. The only thing I'm concerned about is there is a mission, and it, it's just reminds me of A.V.D. Uh, Carrington, who is played by Bert Reynolds, by the way. Um, and it's the one, for those who know the series, played it before, if you're as old as I am. Uh, the one where you're flying the little helicopters, or the little mini RCs. And uh, I think they had to patch it on PC, if you remember right. At the time, I had it on like PlayStation. There was a time Grand Theft Auto was PlayStation exclusive. Anyone remember that? By Raphael's. Alright, so we got our third set of clothing, I believe. Yeah, we've got the suits, we've got a standard. Let's have a listen to the stations, what else have we got? Flash FM. Sometimes, I mean, what I, I'm not going to try and do, because sometimes I get like a little impatient with things when I'm making videos. Do you know what I'm doing? Like, an open, like this is an open world gameplay, as you can see. Um, and I kind of like just start, I remember doing it years ago when I had my old channel, and I did, oh, f forget the name of, of the game, I'll come to me in a minute, and I just kind of like kept transitioning from mission to mission, as opposed to, you know, a little bit in between, having a little chat with you guys, which is, is mostly what I enjoy, other than the cutscenes. Yeah, uh, look at this, um, so I'm going to try and not do that, not get impatient with it, uh, I'm going to. Start fighting with at least four workers to get the right started. Right, one more. Oh, that was only three. Big patrol invest group. <laughs> Take someone else who's holding the weapon, they will drop it. Okay. Alright. The big obvious exploding battle. Whoa, hello. Have the others forgotten about me? I'm Jeff Man back. His little hidden things, yeah. Coverall's outfit deli uh, delivered to tooled up in the North Point Mall, okay. Hola, is this Mr. Versetti? Yeah. Uh, this is Cortez. You were at my party? Yeah, I remember. Uh, Mr. Versetti, it was a most unfortunate incident that happened with your business deal. I know. I want you to know me and my people are doing their utmost to get to the bottom of it. If you'd like to talk to me more privately, you can find me at the bottom there. Okay? Good day, sir. Right, so now it's become a little more open world, uh, and on that note, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, really appreciate the support. Yeah, it's about a 35-40 minute video after that, and I, I don't know yet. But yeah, I'd like... Oh, Christ, hang on. Let me beat this dude up. You asked for this. Yeah, you did. You little punk. I'll take that money. Should we, uh... I'm going to try and... You know, I was looking to the back of his overalls before spandex. Uh, yeah, forgot where it was again. Uh, yeah, guys, thank you once more. Uh, yeah, it's really taking me back this series. Really enjoying it. Oh, I want that car. Hope you guys stick with me. Hope you enjoyed the first part, at least. What I might do, I'll just drive as I'll... I can tell you this. Let me, turn, let me turn that radio off a minute. I might do... Of course, this is the trilogy. I might do the first couple of missions from every... From all three games. And uh, maybe see which one's the most popular uh, with the viewers, with you guys, and maybe do the series on that. I mean, right now, my plan is to do Vice City, but if, like, you guys want to see San Andreas more, uh, you know, I'd rather do that. I play Vice City in my own time, if you see what I mean. So let me know in the comment section which one you want to see. Uh, yeah, and we'll go from there. All right, guys, thank you once more, and I'll see you in the next one.